Hello everyone. Today I'm going to make a mantle clock. This is a idea I got from Michelle. So I am first drawing half the clock here on a piece of paper that I folded and then I'm going to cut it out so I have the shape of my clock. I'm using a piece of brown clay and I'm pushing it into the thickness that I want the clock to be in and then I am just cutting out the shape of my mantle clock in this piece of clay and I'm going to make sure that my uh, cut edges are nice and soft before I bake this in the oven. After baking, I rolled out a piece of brown clay on a setting 7 on my pasta machine and I'm using some bacon bond on the baked part and placing that on the rolled out part. Now I'm just going to cut out this piece so it has the shape just as the uh, mantle clock that I just made. And I am smoothening out the new clay here with my thumb or my index fin finger. Um, over the edge of the baked clay. Then I'm using a hole punch to punch out the hole for the clock face itself. Then I rolled out another piece of brown clay and this time I'm using a setting 2 to make it a bit thicker and I'm measuring the size of my mental clock here on this little piece of clay and then I'm cutting it out in an angle. I'm using a tiny bit of bacon bond to kind of glue the mantle clock on top of this little foot and I'm making this tiny ribbon around the clock because I'm going to roll out its thin piece of clay uh, so that I have kind of a snake and I'm going to place that as a uh, decoration on the clock. Then again I am using some bacon bond to smear over the surface of this little mantle clock and I cut out some tiny pieces of uh, brown clay that I am placing on this little clock and making like a flower of it. Just look here how I'm doing. I'm placing one tiny dot of this brown clay and placing that and um, how you say that, push it into the uh, big clay making these small flowers and leaves and stuff like that. So I decorate my clock just like you see. Make as many flower decorations as you feel like and place them where you like them. I did a few here and I'm going to show you a few of them so just lean back and enjoy. I printed some clock faces out and I gave them a bit of glaze and let them dry. Then I used a light brown citadel paint and I dry brushed the most of the flowers and a few details on this little mantle clock. I cut out the clock face and I'm going to glue that in with a tiny bit of super glue. Then I took a tiny bit of UV resin and placed until this little face and I used a toothpick to make sure it was all out to the edges. 
and I placed it under my UV light. That's all there is for this little mental clock. Thank you for watching and happy crafting.